Russell Brand. In case you didn't know, this guy is in deep shit. I'm Kirsten Langston, author and intuitive, and you can find this video and more videos like it at thirdeyeschampagne.com. You have to be living under a rock not to know what's going on with Russell Brand. But in case you have been living under a rock, or you just don't like reading articles about incredibly disturbing allegations, I got you. The London Times and BBC came out with a, a documentary, basically, about Brand and his inappropriate behavior with women. And when I say inappropriate, it, it, he's being accused of things that he should be put in jail for. I've never forgotten the Katy Perry thing. The fact that he, when he tweeted the picture, the picture where she had no makeup on, clearly in a vulnerable state, she doesn't want her fans to see her that way, otherwise she would have posted the picture herself. I thought that was really sadistic. And then he breaks up with her. Their marriage, their whole ass marriage, via text message. He's gone into major spin mode. His YouTube channel has been demonetized. He's rebranded himself, no pun intended. He's rebranded himself as a YouTube conspiracy theorist, basically. You know, don't listen to the mainstream media. They don't know what they're talking about. I'll tell you the truth. I know all the things. I'm a spiritual guru. I'm reminded of the Russell Simmons situation. It's, oh, I'm the yoga guy and I'm spiritual and I'm, I'm Russell. Maybe it's the name, right? Don't name your children Russell. Don't do it. Long story short, Russell Simmons, same deal. I'm a spiritual guru. Oh, but wait, also there's some R word allegations and he just disappeared. Is the same thing gonna happen to Russell Brand? Possibly. He's definitely been somewhat canceled. YouTube didn't take him down. He can still post, he just can't monetize his channel. He can't make money off of that anymore. He has been taken off the Wanderlust tour. BBC has gone through and taken every single thing he's ever done. Any show he's guest starred on, wherever he's been, they've taken everything down. So he released a video ahead of the allegations and said, oh, these things are gonna come out and they're really horrible and it's not me and I didn't do it. I'm not gonna look at whether or not he did. I am gonna look at the fallout and I think it's gonna be really extensive. I'm gonna start with the boring spiritual stuff first. There's a male-female imbalance with this guy. So that's what's driving the behavior in an energetic spiritual sense, number one. Number two, I wonder, I know that he said, I'm a sex addict, I'm going to Sex Addicts Anonymous or whatever he goes to. I know he said that. I do believe he was an addict addict. And that's coming through here, so an addict addict. I think, I think, so don't quote me on this, but I do believe he was also saying, you know, I, I've imbibed too much. I was doing too much imbibing. There was a lot of imbibing going on and it wasn't healthy. He's coming out as King of Cups. This is traditionally an unstable character. It's our unstable king. It's also our king of addictions. This is our drinker. This is our drug taker. Now, there are legal repercussions, whether it's civil or criminal, but there are legal repercussions. This is a ruiner. He can salvage it. Now, he has a chance. Brand actually has a chance to salvage everything that's actually here in these cards, and I didn't expect to see them. What's floating above him in the Celtic is the Ten Swords in the back, which is, you're done, you're out of here, you're Weinsteined. It's floating above him, not showing up in his future. If Brand were my client, I would say whatever's going on, whatever's going on, come clean, because I don't think he's come clean. I think, nope, 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 I didn't do it, I didn't do it, I didn't do it. That's not gonna be enough. Oh, it was consensual, it was consensual, it was consensual. That's not gonna be enough for him. He's not stable. Or maybe he wasn't stable back when all this stuff went down, but there is an instability showing up in these cards. That should be addressed at the very least. These cards say, hey man, make amends somehow. Make it right. Somehow you gotta make it right. This is, this is like the R. Kelly documentary that got R. Kelly sent to jail. This is it for Brand. If he can come clean, if he can make amends, if he can make these offerings, if he can put things back into balance, he's got a real shot. And I, for one, would actually love to see it. These, these guys, they just stick to their guns. They just go, yeah, yeah, liars, 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 liars. And then they get convicted anyway, right? We're seeing it happen. Why don't you come out and say, you know what? I screwed up. Whatever you need to say for those people to be brought back into balance and those relationships to be made whole as best they can. That's what this man should do. I don't think he's gonna do it, we're gonna look, but if he were my client, that's what I would advise him to do. Oh, this is weird, this is weird. So what he's going to do, we see the chaos behind him, we see, again, a lot of people in his ear and him scrambling and him going, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. He knew, he, he knew, this is it, I'm gonna lose everything. He's not pleasant to read on, quite frankly, away from my cards. I'd rather have the buffer of the cards between he and I. 
but he's not going to do the right thing. He's not gonna do what I would advise him to do as his psychic spiritual advisor. He's like, nope, I'm gonna lie about stuff, I'm gonna obfuscate, I'm gonna be opaque about things, I'm gonna work on this, I'm gonna come out with a show of strength, and I'm a strong man, and I'm this and I'm that, and I, we're just gonna move away from this as quickly as possible. We're just gonna get it out of the way, get it out of the way. He might wanna pay people off. I don't know, he's got money here. But I also see this card as him surrounding himself with people. This could be yes men, this could be lawyers, this could be managers, but he starts surrounding, it, it could be other people he wants to associate with. So you've seen that, that video of Brad Pitt with Adam Sandler, right? Brad Pitt is doing a hell of a job trying to control his reputation after the FBI files came out on Brad Pitt. And it was like, oh no, he did some not great things on that plane. What's with these guys doing bad things on planes? Like, you're not in international waters, it's still gonna count. You see Pitt with Sandler, and it's like, oh look, we're associating him with goofy, sweet Adam Sandler who's never done anything wrong and everybody loves Adam Sandler. So everybody must love Brad Pitt. This may be the tack that Russell Brand also takes. Look at me, I'm hanging out with a great person, and if they think I'm great, then you should think I'm great. He's not gonna let go of the fame, he's gonna, he's gonna churn out the fame machine, whatever that is for him. There is a fame stardom plan here. Here. Let's see if he's successful. He's never going to hit the heights that he hit before. He's done with that. He is done with that. Is he fully canceled? Not fully canceled, but he's done with that. This man manipulated women. Literally, that's what the cards are telling us. Manipulation, women. Now, you could read it as though he empowered women, but it's just not coming through that way. It's reading as though it were upside down. Will his plan work? He's going to throw a lot of money at it. Devil is at the root of the reading though. So he can't really see what I see or what everybody else sees, which is like, you're totally screwed and this tactic is a dumb idea. Devil is at the root of the reading. Sorrow is coming in. He's got his back to everything. He can't see it. There is a botched victory for this man. So this could be an R. Kelly where it's like, oh, he gets away with it. And then 10 years later, it's like, nope, sorry. Now, you know, you're screwed, but it's a botched victory. So there's your victory card and there's your guilty card. It is a botched victory for him. He doesn't come out ahead. People pay attention. And I think more stuff is gonna come out on this guy. I don't think he's done. And okay, that's it, we did it. The documentary came out and, and everything's okay. And then we have more. And then we have more. And then we have more. More likely allegations. This is your sex card. It's This is not. He doesn't, he doesn't fare well. He does not fare well. If you enjoyed this content, you can find more video like these at thirdeyechampagne.com. Don't forget to like, sub, follow, subscribe, and don't forget to drop me a comment because I am picking one person from every social media site to join us for a channeling. You get to ask one question out of any question you want in the whole wide world about the nature of life, death, the other side, God, what have you. We are doing a beautiful channeling, so don't forget to drop your comments in because I'm just randomly gonna pick one person from one video. 